Welcome back to Infigyan my dear friends. In this video we have another very very interesting question from cubic equations. Our equation is x plus 4 whole cube plus x plus 8 whole square equal to 44. So let's get started with our substitution straight away. We will consider x plus 4 equal to t. So x plus 8 will become t plus 4. Let's apply. So equation will become t cube plus t plus 4 whole square equal to 44. Now we can use a plus b whole square formula here. So t cube plus t square plus 8t plus 16 equal to 44. Or we can write t cube plus t square plus 8t minus 28 equal to 0. Now we have one cubic equation which we will solve using factorization method. Let me write t cube plus t square plus 8t minus 28 equal to 0. We can write t cube plus t square plus 8t minus 8 minus 20 equal to 0. Or I can write t cube minus 8. Then we can write t square plus 8t minus 20 equal to 0. Now 8 can be written as 2 cube. So t cube minus 2 cube plus t square plus 8t minus 20 equal to 0. Now here I will apply a cube minus b cube and this is one quadratic expression. We can use method of factorization. So I can write t minus 2 times t square plus 2t plus 4. Here I will be writing t square. Middle term 8t we can split 10t minus 2t. Then minus 20 equal to 0. Now I can take t common from first two terms here. So it will be t plus 10 in the bracket and minus 2 from the last two terms. So t plus 10 will be in the bracket equal to 0. Now I can take t plus 10 overall common. So it will become t plus 10 t minus 2 equal to 0. And here it was t minus 2 times t square plus 2t plus 4 plus. Now you can see t minus 2 t minus 2. So we will take t minus 2 common out. So in the bracket it will be t square plus 2t plus 4 plus t plus 10 equal to 0 or t minus 2 times t square plus 3t plus 14 equal to 0. Let me write here t square plus 3t plus 14 equal to 0 and this was t minus 2. So we can conclude from here either t minus 2 will be equal to 0 or t square plus 3t plus 14 equal to 0. So we have to solve these two equations. Let us solve. I will consider quadratic first. Let's multiply this equation with 4. So I will multiply by 4. So 4t square plus 12t plus 56 equal to 0. 
Now I can split 56. So I will be writing 40 square plus 20 plus 56 can be written as 9 plus 47 equal to 0. Now from these three terms, we can write it is 2t plus 3 whole square plus 47 equal to 0. Or I can write 2t plus 3 whole square will be equal to negative 47. Let me write here 2t plus 3 whole square equal to negative 47. Now we know that a square root of negative 1 is i complex number and minus 1 is i square. So here we can write it is 47 times negative 1, which we can write 47 times i square. So our equation 2t plus 3 whole square will be equal to 47i square. Let us take a square root both sides. So 2t plus 3 will be equal to plus minus i times square root 47. Now I can substitute our substitution. It was t equal to x plus 4. So I can write here 2 times x plus 4 plus 3 equal to plus minus i square root 47. Or I can write 2x plus 8 plus 3, so 11, equal to plus minus i root 47. Subtract 11 from both sides. So 2x will become minus 11 plus minus i times root 47. Now we will divide both sides by 2. So x will become minus 11 plus minus i square root 47 over 2. So two complex solutions are here. Let me write here minus 11 plus minus i times square root 47 over 2. Now I will write our first equation t minus 2 equal to 0. So from here I can write t is equal to 2. t was our substitution x plus 4 equal to 2. Now subtract 4 from both sides. So I can write here x will be equal to 2 minus 4 is minus 2. So we have overall 3 solutions. Let me write here x equal to negative 2, real 1 and the complex solutions are minus 11 plus minus i times square root 47 over 2. Let us verify the real one. So I will write here check and x equal to negative 2. Equation is here. So we can begin from LHS. x plus 4 whole cube plus x plus 8 whole square. So I will write minus 2 plus 4 whole cube plus minus 2 plus 8 whole square. So this will become 2 whole cube plus 6 whole square. This is 8, this is 36, addition will be 44 and this is our RHS. So x equal to minus 2 is our true solution. Verified. I hope friends you will like this video. Thank you so very much for watching. Do not forget to like, share and subscribe. Till next video, goodbye.